Now for a discovery which may surprise you. Scientists have found that most of us still have a little bit of a Neanderthal inside us. A study into the DNA of the human subspecies found that they interbred with modern humans tens of thousands of years ago, and their genetic mark remains today. BBC's Palab Ghosh has more on these extraordinary findings. 60,000 years ago, our ancestors emerged from Africa. They dispersed across the globe to form the other races of the world we have today. As they left, they encountered another kind of human, much like us, the Neanderthals. This is a skull of a modern human, and this is from a Neanderthal. Look closely and you can see that this one has a slightly longer brain case. Most scientists believe that these are two separate species, and there wasn't much interaction between the two. But now we know there was interbreeding, and that all non-Africans living today are part Neanderthal. The researchers extracted DNA from Neanderthal fossils and compared it with that taken from people living today. They found that the DNA of Europeans and Asians is 2% Neanderthal. It's a very exciting discovery because it gives us really the first strong evidence that there was interbreeding with people like the Neanderthals. And it means that modern humans in different parts of the world may have slightly different mixes of modernity and these more primitive genes. Further analysis should give a greater insight into how Neanderthals lived and shed more light on our own early origins. Halad Ghosh, BBC News. And the Neanderthal in me has always said, Neanderthal, I stand quite corrected. Coming up next here on BBC World News America.